Okay, so today I'm going to make you some digital art again and we are on the computer and I have some pictures over here and these are these are older pictures. This one was taken, you know, last winter time out of snow. I hope that this winter I will also get good pictures, but I have kind of realized that in this style I have tended to kind of split the folders up. This was from some exhibition of art, I think, like, yeah, it, I think it was from Helsinki, you know. And yeah, it, it, was, it was a long time ago I took the picture, but I realized that you should just slap your, all of your pictures in the one folder and just kind of scroll it up and down and just find pictures that are kind of interesting on their own and then just going from it like this like that there's a lot of there's a lot of stuff over here this is from my town an older picture it's just it's just i think it was from a kind of a reflection from a water bottle you know in the in the darkness was, i think it was the ta darkest time of the year with no snow anymore Kind of the early start of the spring. So we're going to going to use that as a layer also. I'm going to put it like this. Just rotate it a bit. Oh no, no, not that layer. This layer. I don't know why, but my computer is kind of struggling to process this stuff. I really need to get better hardware. Just try to make it pretty straight. Fine. And we're gonna delete this tree. We're gonna look at two pictures over here that are you know really this picture is pretty bad, it's pretty out of focus, but that don't matter because we're gonna use it like this. <laughs> That's pretty clever pretty clever like that then like this <laughs> that looks cool that looks cool This for this was from an installation art thing that featured all kinds of LED lights and when I took these pictures I wasn't I wasn't yet doing actually this process it only came later at least not like this you know I invented this like later So you would kind of never realize that that's not actually, that thing over there is not actually part of the picture. Okay. One picture at a time. Problem with these photos is that they're taken with my older camera and they can be, you know, not so, they might not be so high quality. But the camera has a lot more zoom, so it's easier to take these kind of kind of shots and I really need better hardware in many ways, you know, I need a better computer and I need I need a better
better computer and also maybe better camera equipment. Okay, we're gonna use this layer as the bottom most layer. Something like that. Oh, man, I dig that. That's that looks fun. Okay, so. This part is kind of distract, not like doesn't it doesn't like blend into the picture so so well but that's kind of separated man that looks cool there was a lot of pictures actually that were taken out of other people's art in this this one That's it. I think that's it. <laughs> oh man, man, it looks cr that looks like some kind of some kind of spaceship, you know, landing or something like that. Like man, it, it it brings to mind so much, you know, stories maybe. I'm gonna make just a couple of these versions from here also but these are not gonna be used in any way that's the final picture so I'm not that but let's go let's go back a bit that's it that's it okay that's it and then we're gonna sign it some kind of a sci-fi font over here What were the sci-fi fonts so in this? It's a very interesting process because the people that are doing this, these things that I have photographed would have no idea that they are actually, you know, It's kind of like I'll make what you all of you are doing work together. Okay, so here's the final picture. You can find the picture in the description below. The link is over there and I don't know if this font really matches the picture, but you can also find the one without the signature over there. Thanks for watching.